What are you doing? I'm learning all about 3D mammography at Riverside. You really don't need the 3D glasses I to don't? do that. Nope, you just need to talk to Dr. Ramakrishna about 3D mammography. I just did, and I learned everything you need to know about 3D mammography here at Riverside. Well, let's take a look. Thank you for joining us, Dr. Ramakrishna. This is an exciting piece of technology that we've just added here at Riverside. 3D mammography, what does that mean to the women of the region? 3D mammography is a new technology here at Riverside. It's a great addition to our breast center. Um, this technology is great because it's really increasing our ability to detect cancers, specifically invasive cancers, which uh, traditionally um, have been difficult to detect in patients with certain breast densities, such as dense breasts. Um, and we're very excited to have this technology here in our community. So how does 3D mammography work? Well, the machine actually takes the standard uh, 2D view um, mm -hmm. that most women are uh, familiar with when getting their mammogram. But after that, the unit actually rotates around in an arc over the breast and obtains several low-dose images. Uh, these images are then reconstructed uh, using computer software to give us the 3D images, allowing us to scroll through the breast and actually see areas that may not be visible with traditional 2D mammography. Uh, specifically, we're looking for those invasive cancers um, or areas of distortion in the breast that can be very difficult to see on standard mammography. You know, when you are looking at, at 3D mammography, are there statistics that back up that it is a, a better type of technology to use? Absolutely. Um, there have been several studies that have um, looked at 3D mammography and specifically, um, one study has shown a 41% increase in detection of invasive cancers. And invasive cancers are the ones that we want to detect early, um, that we can treat early and uh, improve patients' outcomes. I've heard of false callbacks. Sometimes people receive callbacks. Is, does the technology have any um, impact on those type of, of callbacks? That's an excellent question. Um, there's been a lot of discussion about callbacks recently. Um, callbacks can be a source of anxiety mm -hmm. um, for patients, and this new technology is actually reducing the number of callbacks that we have because we can evaluate certain findings in the breast uh, with the 3D uh, technology uh, without having to call the patients back and see that it's normal tissue um, without having to do additional testing or um, imaging. So we've got great technology, some of the most advanced that there is. We have wonderful expertise that are going to help with the earlier detection for women if they are diagnosed with cancer. What are the next steps that they can expect? That's a great question. Um, with this technology, we're able to diagnose those cancers earlier, and it means that they can get in to see a surgeon or an oncologist, and if so, also a radiation oncologist. Uh, for treatment sooner and by detecting cancers in their earliest stages or when they're smaller we're improving outcomes for patients um, so they can get back to being healthy uh, and continue uh, enjoying their life. So someone who is detected with cancer has a great team behind them here at Riverside then to fight that battle. Absolutely, um, we're a part of a multidisciplinary team here uh, at the Breast Center. Um, we're just one component of the patient's treatment uh, course which may include surgery, um, oncology and radiation oncology and uh, we're proud to be um, part of that uh, team that's uh, helping the patient. That's great to know that you have that power and that precision behind you right here at Riverside. So thank you very much Dr. Ramakrishna. I appreciate your time. Thank you. Well it sounds like the key is early detection. It certainly is and to learn more about early detection and breast cancer awareness go to healthcurrents.com. What should we do now? How about we go see a movie? We got the glasses, why not? Let's do it.